Good morning, I'm Linda Taylor, and I want to share with you from 1 Samuel um, chapter 17. And this is the part where David is going to King Saul so that he can fight and defeat Goliath. Now, he has some convincing to do because David is just a boy at this point. He's never fought a battle. He has fought against a lion and a bear. And that's what he, in fact, tells King Saul. And right here in 38, he says, The Lord who delivered me from the paw of the lion and the paw of the bear will deliver me from the hand of the Philistine. So Saul said to David, Go, and the Lord be with you. But after that, this is what Saul did. It said, Then Saul dressed David in his own tunic. He put a coat of armor on him and a bronze helmet on his head. So David fastened on his sword over the tunic and tried walking around because he was not used to them. And David said, I cannot go in these because I am not used to them. Now, my kids and I have been studying this, and I thought to myself, at that point in my own life, how many times have I set out to do something that I thought the Lord had told me to do and not been bold like David and not had the boldness to take off someone else's armor. David was young, but he was bold. He was bold enough to say, I'm not used to this. When Saul tried to cover him in his own armor, he was bold enough and wise enough to understand that he could not use the covering that King Saul tried in his own effort, in his own care to cover him because he wasn't trying to do something to harm David. He was trying to help him. And, but David didn't apologize about it. He didn't look back. He just simply said and boldly said, I can't use these. And he took them off. And then he went about his own business, doing things with the way that God had made him, with the way that God had prepared him. And he went out and he picked up the stones. And the word says that he went. And it says right here that he went and he took his staff in his hand and chose five smooth stones. And I'm so glad to have this word, to know that all I need to do, that if God tells me to do something, I don't need to worry about what my neighbor's doing and how God has anointed them. I just need to worry about, God, what did you tell me to do? Because that's what David did. David approached King Saul, who was a mighty warrior, a mighty king at that time, and said, I'm going to fight Goliath. And he listened to King Saul, but then he stepped out and said, I can't do it this way, Saul. I'm going to do it how I'm made to do it. And he stepped out with five little stones. And in the same way, I only need to do things the way God tells me to do it, to knock down my Goliaths in my life. And that's such a good word to me, to know that's all God asks of me. But wow, what a great word to me, because I'm totally prepared to do everything that God needs me to do. It doesn't have to be something great big. Five little stones. And David did something that all those mighty men couldn't do with five little stones. So whatever it is, whatever that Goliath is in your life, I don't know, but God does. And whatever that is, God already has prepared you to face it. And whatever that little stone is, know that it's a huge anointing. Be blessed this week. I love you.